Hi everyone, today I bought this cassette tape recorder from a bargain shop. I don't know what's wrong with it, I don't know whether it is working or not, but I think there is something loose inside or something broken, I don't know. So anyway, I just plug it in the power protection bulb and see whether it will work or not. If not, I, we will open it up and see what's wrong with it and try to repair it. As you can see, there is no sound coming out. But uh, we have here a pilot light, which means that the bar circuit is okay. So now the problem we have is uh, with the amplifier circuit. Let's open top and see. Don't use violence while trying to open it. The first thing we have to do is take a snapshot of all this wiring so that whenever there is a, a wire is cut, we don't turn around in circles. We leave the cassette problem to, for some time we have to, to start first with the amplifying problem. We'll have to remove this so that we, uh, we check the volume control. Now check whether the problem is with the volume control or not. We'll just uh, try to make two, uh, two ends here in contact. Okay, if there's sound comes out, so it means that the volume control is faulty. If there is nothing, so we have to look for something else. Now let's plug it in and see whether there will be sound coming out or not. There is nothing. This means that the problem is not with the volume control. So um, I think this might do with either the, the amplifier RC or one of the capacitors is gone. So how can we know? We, uh, we have to test all the capacitors, but there are many, so many. So what are we to do? I have something better. It is a little bit primitive, but it does work sometimes, okay? Uh, well, uh, we can wet one of our fingers and try to feel all the capacitors. If we hear a tiny sound, this means that this capacitor is gone and we replace it. Of, uh, of course, this method saves time. We can test all the capacitors, but this method, uh, sometimes it doesn't work, but sometimes it works. So it saves time, that's all. And uh, if all the capacitors, if you, you did not uh, actually find anything, you see, you, uh, you just... Uh, test all the capacitors of uh, all the capacitors are okay, are okay so it is the amplifier i see i have to replace it okay now let's start by feeling all the capacitors i'll uh, wet one of my fingers and uh, try so, the capacitors around the amplifier i see yes yes this is the one so it is this one this capacitor it's it is a 220 micro by 16 volts. Well, uh, now I replace this capacitor, then I'll check whether there is other problems or not. It doesn't seem bad, but it is shorted. So uh, I'll replace it with this one. This is, uh, anyway, this is 220 um, micro. 25 volts it will do 
Now after replacing the capacitor, still there is no sound. We know that the volume control, this volume control is okay. Okay, now there is sound. But the radio sound is not coming out. So still there is a problem. The problem is because of another bad capacitor or these controls. One of these controls is faulty. Yes, now I can hear a sound. I can hear the radio sound. So this control is faulty. Okay, I will replace this control and see. As for those two uh, bent bends, we have to remove them using a screwdriver like this one. And while heating, we just uh, remove them. Okay? If we try to remove them without uh, the, the iron, you will spoil the board. Like this. Here we go. You see? We have to remove the flux to make sure that there is no solder left. I'm going to replace this control but I'm afraid the problem is not because of this control alone but the problem has to do with this board. Okay, so I'll replace it and see. Now I've replaced this control and the problem still exists. So we'll check the resistance. See that resistance? I think it is gone. So let's replace it and see. So this is the resistance we are going to replace. Now it is working alright, it needs only an antenna. Can you see? So we will make an antenna. You see with an insulated uh, wire like this one, copper wire like this one, and uh, we'll wind it around a screwdriver. Here it is, but this time it is much longer than the previous one. Okay, we made it like a spring this way. Uh, we shall see whether it will give us better results than the previous time or not, because it is much longer. Okay, as well, we need a smaller one. And this is too small. I think this one will do. This one is okay, and the other one. Okay. It is okay now. As you can see, this uh, bench roller needs to be replaced because it is cracked. We have to 
invest in this part, but I'm afraid I don't have a spare part. I only have the rendel. Okay, I only have the, this rendel. This is the same size, so I'll replace it. We take out that bin this way. كده خلاص تمام It's okay now. I'll put it back. As you can see, it is working now, all right? As you can see, it is working now, all right? Because of the antenna we, we made inside, Now it is time to restore it to the factory to fault. Now it is time to restore it to the factory default. But as you can see, there is rust here. The rust will not go. We will spray it. Okay. Now let's start. As you can see, it doesn't remove the writing because it contains very little anti-grease. So be careful with the anti-grease. Antigrease also removes the paint. You see, it works like magic. All the paint is gone. No more paint at all. Okay, and the writing is still there. Because as I told you before, we only add little, very little antigrease. Not much. Now I'll remove any excess solution with the blower. Now 
I'll dry it up with a clean uh, rug. Now I've got it prepared for spray. I have to shake it well before use. When I spray, I spray from a distance, not directly. That's it. Right. The other side, this is enough for one side. That's all, not much. Now I'll just leave it to dry up for some time. It is very important to put dinner in the cap because uh, the bint dries up, then you cannot use it afterwards. So uh, after each use, we we uh, we put uh, thinner so that it um, it doesn't uh, dry up. It is very important, or else you'll throw away this bottle because you want to find the cap like this. Here it is after one hour, as good as new. Please don't forget subscribe, share, and like. See you in a new video. Bye for now.